What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Tommy Kentner here if you're dropping in for the first time. Today guys, we are going to pick up a S209 of Adams. This is Adams. He was actually the owner of the Raptor I just picked up. And he's the one that let us do the review on the Supra and the C8. So uh, we're going to go pick up his S209. And it's going to be the first time we get to see one in person. So let's get going. Guys, this is 68 of 209. Okay. So the man is going to put a number in for you. So you have your three-year stable for a three-year, five-year. Oh, then you have your seven-year option. What all does that cover? It's got the S209 shift knob, which it looks really good. I really like this pink trim. It looks super clean. Alright guys, it is a totally silicone hose. And once again, 69 of 209. And this is conical, right? Oh wow. Yeah, and then they got like a bowl. And then the new filter, like this is different. Huh. And then the turbo's even got STI on it too. If you can see it. Right. Or something. Like apparently this thing still flexes. Yeah. yeah. I would say yes, but I also want to It has this upgraded bar. It has this in the back too. I'm pretty sure the seats don't fold down because of it. Oh, really? You got the sprayer. Is that oh, here? yeah. Water spray. Like the old school. 04 through 07. But uh, we're going to cruise a little bit in the S209, uh, give you some feedback. Just from driving it from the dealership to where we had to return the rental car, um, it does feel more solid, like real stiff. Um, and the turning kind of feels a little bit more mechanical. Um, other than that, I think it feels like the same STI and then what we're going to do is get it broke in, uh, go over some things and then we'll see how it feels under boost once we get it properly broke in, get the oil changed uh, and go from there. It does have this real slick uh, red S209, um, different shift knob than standard which it, they really just did it black but I know it's a JDM thing. And then the radio looks pretty standard. And that intelligent mode. Uh, you got STI in the middle right here. Yeah, STI there. And it's got the, like, 
a gray stitching and then yeah, it goes all the way around yeah plaque right there and then gray bolsters too so a little bit different than the standard sti and then oh and the exhaust has like a more it it's a little bit louder than the factory stis but still not loud enough <laughs> I really see a in, in video coming soon. <laughs> yeah, this thing will just feel way better when uh, you get that rumble out back for sure. Yeah, it makes the driving experience too. But um, overall, like the the just the sheer appearance of it really just kind of sets it off. It's all about that wide body. Yeah, the fenders look look it, wild. Yeah, they the pictures just don't do the car justice. Because in person, it, it does look pretty crazy. guys some things we noticed in the first 40 miles we put a lot of miles on this car <laughs> um, the ride is a little bit firmer and the car is just planted like the extra tires I mean and it just zings from side to side um, taking some high-speed cornering on the way back but uh, overall like wait till the noise stop but uh it's actually rides a little better i would think than the yeah i mean i just drove uh the test drove a series white a couple weeks ago and uh this feels totally different looks totally different you know yeah. 20 grand more probably should get you that anyway but yeah and some more power <laughs> <laughs> and and you can actually tell like we haven't really got on it but just, uh, I mean, you could tell it's there. Uh, it's just a little bit like we've actually like, you know how you're riding in sixth gear and you give it a little bit just to get up the hill. It actually doesn't have any tr trouble like pulling up the hills. So can't wait to get it broke in and then we'll uh, take it through some proper roads in Mexico <laughs> and uh, see what it's about. But guys, um, thank y'all for watching. I think we'll end this one here. It's just a quick introduction of the S209. And we'll be doing a pretty good little stuff to it. Like, nothing major because, I mean, technically, it's pretty much super race car from the factory. Um, and it is the only STI made by STI, so that's kind of cool. And this is, like I said, uh, it's 68 of 209. So a real low number car too. Um, but we got a pretty good drive back and we're gonna head back. It's probably gonna get dark. And then uh, the next video will go more of a walk around. There's a little bits and pieces of, of this one in here. But in the next one, we'll give you a, a better walk around and maybe even a better ride if he's got the miles on it. But I'll see y'all in the next episode. Peace.